Welcome to Ask Prep, your trusted companion for UPSC and IS preparation. Today we will study about a very important topics of Indian geography which is underscore Indian lakes. India, with its vast and diverse geography, is home to numerous lakes that hold cultural, ecological and economic significance. These lakes, scattered across the country, vary in their origin, type and purpose. From glacial lakes in the Himalayas to saline lakes in the desert regions, each has its unique story and importance. Let's explore some of the most notable lakes in India, understanding their features and relevance. Starting in the north, we find Dal Lake in Jammu and Kashmir. Known as the Jewel in the Crown of Kashmir, Dal Lake is famous for its pristine beauty, shikaras and houseboats. It is a freshwater lake that plays a pivotal role in the region's tourism and local economy. Moving to Himachal Pradesh, we encounter the Chandratal or Moon Lake nestled in the Lahol and Spiti Valley. This high-altitude glacial lake attracts trekkers and adventurers, offering breathtaking views and a serene environment. The Pangong Tso, located in Ladakh, is another remarkable high-altitude lake. It is endoric, meaning it has no outflow, and its saline water is known for changing colors throughout the day. This lake gained international fame after being featured in popular films but also holds geopolitical importance due to its location near the India-China border. Heading towards the northeast, Loktak Lake in Manipur stands out. It is the largest freshwater lake in northeastern India and is renowned for its Fumdis floating islands composed of vegetation and organic matter. The Kebul Lamjao National Park, located on these Fumdis, is the only floating national park in the world and home to the endangered Sangai deer. In Rajasthan, we find the Sambhar Lake, India's largest inland saltwater lake. It plays a crucial role in salt production and is also a heaven for migratory birds, including flamingos. The Sambhar Lake is steeped in history, with references dating back to ancient Indian texts. In the southern part of India, Chilika Lake in Odisha is a prominent feature. It is the largest coastal lagoon in India and the second largest brackish water lagoon in the world. Chilika is a hotspot for biodiversity, supporting a variety of fish, birds, and aquatic species. The lake is especially known for hosting migratory birds during the winter season, making it a favorite destination for bird watchers. Further south, we encounter the Vembanad Lake in Kerala, the longest lake in India. It is integral to Kerala's backwater tourism and sustains local livelihoods through fishing and agriculture. Houseboats cruising along the Vembanad Lake are a major attraction for tourists from around the globe. Another notable mention is Pulikat Lake, located on the border of Andhra Pradesh and Tamil Nadu. This brackish water lagoon is a vital habitat for flamingos and other migratory birds. The lake supports traditional fishing communities and plays a crucial role in the region's ecological balance. Apart from these, Saatal in Uttarakhand is a group of interconnected lakes known for their pristine beauty and biodiversity. Similarly, Nainital Lake, a kidney-shaped natural freshwater lake, is a popular tourist attraction and holds mythological significance. Lonar Lake in Maharashtra is another unique feature of India's geography. Formed by a meteorite impact, it is one of the few hypervelocity impact crater lakes in the world. Its high alkalinity and distinct ecosystem make it a subject of scientific interest. Lakes also face significant challenges. Urbanization, pollution, and climate change are major threats to these water bodies. For example, the pollution in Dal Lake and encroachment around Bhojtal highlight the need for urgent conservation efforts. Additionally, saline lakes like Sambhar face issues of reduced water inflow and over-exploitation. Moving to Uttarakhand, the Nainita Lake, nestled in the Kumon Hills, is a natural freshwater lake that attracts thousands of visitors annually. The high-altitude lakes of Pangong Tso and Tso Moriri in Ladakh are other remarkable examples. These glacial lakes, with their breathtaking landscapes, are biodiversity hotspots, home to migratory birds and unique aquatic life. To preserve these natural treasures, India has implemented several conservation programs. The National Wetland Conservation Program and initiatives under the Ramsar Convention aim to protect and sustain these ecosystems. 
community participation, sustainable tourism practices, and strict pollution control measures are essential for ensuring the longevity of these lakes. Lastly, we must talk about Wooler Lake in Jammu and Kashmir, one of the largest freshwater lakes in India. It serves as an important source of fish and water for the surrounding communities while acting as a natural flood reservoir, mitigating the impact of heavy rains in the valley. India is also home to several man-made lakes. The Gobind Sagar Lake in Himachal Pradesh, created by the Bhakranangal Dam, serves as a crucial reservoir for irrigation and hydroelectricity. The Hirakud Reservoir in Odisha, formed by the Hirakud Dam on the Mahandi River, is one of the longest artificial lakes in the world and significantly contributes to flood control and water management. In southern India, the Vembanad Lake in Kerala, the largest lake in the state, is central to the region's backwater tourism and fishing industries. The Koleru Lake in Andhra Pradesh, a freshwater lake, acts as a natural flood balancing reservoir and supports a vibrant bird sanctuary. Similarly, the Pulikat Lake, a brackish water lagoon shared between Andhra Pradesh and Tamil Nadu, is known for its ecological importance and the annual Flamingo Festival. India's lakes are more than just water bodies. They are reservoirs of biodiversity, centers of cultural and historical significance, and lifelines for millions of people. However, these lakes face threats such as pollution, encroachment, and climate change. Preserving and restoring them is essential not just for the environment but also for sustaining the livelihoods and heritage they support. As we conclude this journey through India's lakes, remember their importance in our natural and cultural heritage. For UPSC and IS aspirants, these lakes not only represent geographical features but also intersect with topics like environment, biodiversity, and sustainable development. Dive deeper into these subjects, and you'll discover how these lakes mirror India's incredible diversity and resilience. Thank you, this is Ask Prep, your guide to mastering UPSC and IS preparation. Let's decode complex topics and simplify your journey to success.